Some new developments on that hoarding case in the Northwest Valley. Everything from pigs to zebras found on an acre property near Anthem. And now the owner, a former police officer, is behind bars. ABC 15's Allison Rodriguez is live near the property. And Allison, uh, the sheriff's department is calling this one of the worst cases they've ever seen. Yeah, that's right, Katie. We're talking more than 100 animals in desperate need of care. Uh, and they're still getting the rest of those animals that were left behind after that initial seizure uh, there, the first raid. Now, 62-year-old Andrea McKell was booked into the 4th Avenue jail today. She could be facing 80 counts of animal cruelty. MCSO officials say almost the entire inside of her house was covered in animal feces. Some piles high, as almost a foot high. There were spider webs on most of the walls and the entryways there. Also different cages of pigeons, roosters, rabbits, and quail all throughout her house. Also, a lot of the roughly 100 animals had open uh, sores. Well, the ones who were living on the inside and they needed a medical attention when they found them last month. They didn't find any food or water for them either. MCSO telling us Mickle admitted to having a problem but refused to give up her animals. Sheriff Arpaio is saying these cases are popping up way too often. So we got a big problem in this valley regarding abuse of animals, hoarding, I can, and the vicious conditions that they live in, not only affecting the house, what about all the neighbors that have to live around this garbage? Yeah, well, veterinarians are now checking in with those animal, animals, I should say, trying to get them healthy again. Meantime, we did speak with some neighbors who said they're just happy those animals are now going to get proper care. Yeah, that's just it. We're learning more about this sad issue because it's happening more and more, but hopefully we're getting closer to a solution as well. Allison Rodriguez reporting live for us tonight. Thank you.